Hey guys, welcome back to another Clash Royale video, and today we're playing around with a really interesting Mega Knight Hogwarter deck that's been absolutely destroying in Clash Royale. 4.3 average elixir, guys. This deck's an absolute beast. You have Hogwarter Mega Knight, obviously. You have a bit of Zap Bait in here as well, with the Skeleton Army and the Sparky. Executioner Natal for all of the witches right now. Mega Knight, obviously, for, for wall breakers, and the Ewas is in there, because Sparky is pretty popular as well in all of those Eagolem decks. So overall, Pretty nasty deck. Uh, right here, guys, are the stats of the deck according to Real API. As you can see, it currently has just about a 60% win rate, uh, being used for over 2,000 battles, or almost 2,000 battles recently in Clash Royale. Uh, so, very, very interesting deck, guys. Very, very interesting deck. Almost 2,000 battles played. Uh, 56 point something percent win rate, just about rounding up to 60%. And, uh, yeah, absolutely insane, guys. 4.3 is pretty heavy for a hog deck. But you have a, hot, a lot of heavy stuff in this deck, guys. You got Mega Knight, you got Spark, you got Executioner. Like, all the jazz you need, basically. Now, TT. What you got for me, dude? Hmm. Sparky first play is risky. We're gonna go E-Wizard actually here. Not ideal, but out of all the options we had, probably one of the uh, only options we had. <laughs> what are the chances he's got Rocket? I've been seeing a lot more Rockets in the meta right now. So, it could be risky going Sparky right there. But you got my dude. Ooh. This here. Wait for it. This here. Nice. I want to go the, uh, the Skarmy second. Not first. Just because of the... Um, what do you call it there? Just because of that. Of that stuff right there. That we just mentioned. Got this. That zap forces the tower to retarget to my hog rider, allowing the executioner to survive right there. And that should be tower, guys. That should be tower. There we go. That should be tower. Nice. All right, GG's. GG's. We should be good to go for the win here, guys, unless I make a mistake, like that rocket in last yesterday's video. <laughs> Which we won't mention it, all right? You guys promised me. But uh, <laughs> that was that was bad. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, ATT. What you got, dude? Where's your giant? I don't want to go Sparky until he goes giant, basically, because Sparky will destroy the giant. But uh, everything here is just not really ideal. I guess the E Wizard is my best choice for cyclage. Uh, e Wizard here. He might have just given up, so we'll kind of see. I was thinking he might have given up, but I just didn't want to risk it and be like, oh, he gave up and go all in. And then all of a sudden have him kind of not give up. But uh, it appears he did. It appears he did. Which I'm kind of okay with. I can take the free win. So, thank you for the three crown on the trophies, TT. Much appreciate. Good game. Well played. <laughs> so, it's always nice when that goes your way. It's, it's never really often that a battle like that happens where it just goes your way immediately. But uh, I'll take it when it happens, man. I'll take it when it happens. So... Let's jump into the battle over here, guys. Keep it going. Keep it going. We have Hogwarts starting hand, so that might... I was going to say... I wanted to say most likely, but I went to say might likely. Um, if this is Expo, we're just dead. If this is Expo, we're dead. If this is Ice Bow, we're even deader. Hmm. The one thing that card counters this deck like crazy is Expo and uh, Expo. Just destroys this deck. But it appears it is a uh, Valkyrie Executioner. I'm going to guess Rocket deck. I'm going to guess Rocket just because Rocket is most popular in that strategy. But um, we shall see. I'm going to see Valkyrie Executioner. There's the Valkyrie. Yep. What do you guys think? Executioner and Rocket or Executioner and Lightning Spell? I think Rocket is by far the, uh, the spell of choice in this current meta. There's Executioner. If it is indeed the rocket, we shall see it. Right, meow. Pew. Oh, it's lightning spell. It makes my life so much easier, dude. That makes my life so much so. I'm so happy, man. I'm so happy right now, dude. Ah, uh, if I was faster, my zap spell, maybe get a. If I was more predictive with my Zap spell, we could have got the uh, King Tower tower hit there. But Lightning Spell makes this battle so much simpler for us. 
Like, honestly, it's way, way, way better now. I'm okay with that. I was scared it was going to be a rocket, but indeed it's not. Indeed it's not. Will the execution is going to go in there or die? What is that? What did I just say? Was that even English? Can someone decipher what I just said, please? Somebody please decipher what I just had mentioned. Ay, 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 dude. He's gonna nail that together. Yes, he do. Now we go Sparky here. The lightning spells it, guaranteed. Nail us back here. Okay, we good with that. Hog here. He's gonna go do the log spell right here. Yes. There we go, baby. That's the predictive uh, spell that I wanted before. That right there, my friends, is the predictive spell that I wanted previously that we did not get. Alright, he's gonna go Valkyrie. That Valkyrie will just. Oh, he's gonna log that back? I'm actually highly okay with that. Sparky here. Kill the uh, execution, please, Sparky. Now kill that Valkyrie, please, Sparky. One shot the tower, please? Sparky, you noob! You official noob saw Sparky. I will not forgive you for that for that right there. You are not forgiven. You are officially going into noob saw status right now. Alright? Officially noob sauce. Where's your lightning spell? Haha, <laughs> I knew you had it. Knew he had it. Alright, we good. So we're gonna go. Hog Rider here. He's gonna go NATO Executioner for that. NATO right here. Yeah, I'm okay with that. I'm actually really okay with that. We're gonna go Executioner here. We got one Hog Shot. That's all I needed. Wait for it. Boom. Wait for this. Boom. Nice. What you got, buddy? What you got? He was here. I get some work done. Nice there. Nice. Now let's together kill the, uh, the executioner with the uh, Mega Knight assisting. I'll right here. The lightning spells this. No lightning spell here. Log spell now though. We might get one hog shot if we're lucky, but probably not. No. Gonna get this here. He's gonna lightning spell it. I don't, I don't know why I keep using my Mega Knight there. All right, we good, we good, we good. Make it here, please. Nice, dude, nice. I'm okay with that. Where's your needles back here? Come on, baby. Mega Knight jump, please. Oh, he was to finish it off. He was he had to right now. He he's got no chance. Good game, man. Good game. Good game. <laughs> oh man, that was close. Not really that. Oh, I mean, it was kind of close. Got 600 health on our tower. I don't know why I kept using my Sparky in that spot. I mean, there's not really any place that I could use the Sparky though, right? Anywhere that I would use it, he could Lightning Spell it. If I use it at the river, then he could just go Execution and destroy it, right? So regardless of where I go... Um, but I think playing that... We went really aggressive at the end there was really, I think, well played. Man, I can't speak today. What's wrong with me today, man? I really, honestly, I haven't been getting a whole lot of sleep the last couple of nights. If you guys were wondering why... My past few videos are uh, late uploads. I mentioned it yesterday. Life's been crazy busy. Been um, just kind of a bit overwhelmed right, uh, right now. So I haven't had a whole lot of sleep. Which I think is part of the problem in terms of not uh, speaking properly. My, t my, my, my brain is very fatigued. If I had any left. Are you freaking... I just want Mega Knight. I hate my life right now. I just want freaking Mega Knight. And he's got freaking three musketeers, dude. Why the heck did I go my Gnite opening play? Honestly, because I had nothing else in my in my hand. Freak, that sucks. I'm a noob. What? What? Is this real life? Did y'all see that? Wow. I, I can't, I literally can't believe it, guys. I'm not even joking right now. The, the battle ram connected, despite the execution of doing some work. And then the barbarian survived the musketeer tank. That whole just, that whole thing overall, to me, was just strange. 
Middle this. Honestly, guys, ever since we, ever since the first play there, when we went, uh, when we went, uh, what do you call it? Mega Knight for that mi that miner. I think we're dead. I think we're dead. Ever since that first play where you went Mega Knight for that miner, I think we're not doing too hot right now. That's what that was. That's what was supposed to happen, but it didn't. Musketeers here, maybe. With this. Kill the, kill the next one. Oh, two out of three. I'll take that, Jazz. Any day of the week. I'm gonna go E Wizard right here for this. Nice. Blitz Garmy here. Mega Knight here, I guess. If he goes Minion Heart, we're gonna go Nato Zap it. Right here. This. Come on, baby. You got this, Mega Knight. One more shot, Mega Knight, please. Thank you, Mega Knight. I appreciate you. I should give you a raise. But nope, I won't. Good game. <laughs> well played. Oh man, that was a that was a roller coaster of emotions, that battle. <laughs> we were winning and then we were losing and then we were winning. By the way, did I ask this already in this video? Did I ask this already? Let's do one more battle here, guys. Uh, what do you think of the uh, of the beard progress? I keep asking you a lot, but what I want you guys to do um, is go back two months ago. I think it's around when I started the the growing process because uh, I used to keep it super short. So I've been growing it out uh, for about two months now. Maybe not two months in, on the dot, but Sparky, thank you for doing nothing. Thank you, Sparky. Thank you for being utterly useless. I really appreciate just the, the the lack of anything that you just did right there for me. Thank you, Sparky. I should, uh, yeah, just the thank you for, for doing nothing. Freaking noob. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice, dude. Look at that, Jazz. Why didn't that stop the fire spits, you say? Good question. Anyways, as I was saying, guys, about two months ago is when I started the whole the whole growing it up process. And uh, let me know what you think. Go back about two months ago, click on the video, and see what it looked like then, and see what it looked like now. And uh, we'll kind of see how it goes. Actually, you know what? I might just throw a, I might just throw a uh, what do you call it? Green shot on screen right now. Yes, and then you guys can tell me. Let's just go Sparky, whatever, guys. The Sparky has proven itself to be pretty useless, but uh, we'll do it. We'll try it again, anyways. Nice. One of these. That tanks that jazz. He was it here. Nice, dude. Nice poison, buddy. I'm gonna go. He was it right now. I was hoping he wouldn't, but I knew he would. I knew he's that kind of guy to do that. Grab me here. All right, we are not doing too hot right now. We're not doing too hot right now. Um, honestly, though, I'm not surprised. We don't really have the best graveyard counters in this deck. I I, I feel like it's not really suited well to counter the graveyards. What's with my cards just being nubs today? Uh, the first the Sparky, now the execution to just literally do nothing. Yikes, man. Major yikes, man. I got it here. Boom. Nice. Kill that, please. Oh, I see ya. Come on, baby. I'll right into the furnace here. Nail this all back. Come on, baby. That NATO was questionable. That NATO was questionable. Hmm. The plot thickens, my dudes. The plot does indeed thicken right now. There we go. Come on, baby. Get it, Megan. Get it, Megan. Go, 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 Megan. Go. Needless back. 
No, he nailed at the same time. I'm so sad. I'm so sad right now, guys. I'm so sad. Right this, right this. Come on, baby. He was he here? I'm gonna go hog right here, guys. It's risky, but we'll just do it. What? I don't even care, man. Whatever. If we lose, who cares, right? It's just trophies. It's just my pride on the line. This is my pride, right? No, you stupid nub. Tank. All right. Our last chance, boys. Right here, dude. We're going to go for it. I don't care. Yellowing it. Yes. Jump. Megan, I jump. Yes, I'm good with that. One more of those. Now we go hog rider here. We might win. Like this. Is it going to work or no? Is he back to Furnace? No, he nails it. We're so dead. Oh, no, 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 no. No, we're so dead. Good game, broski. Honestly, for a battle where we don't really have... Yeah, that's that's tower. The tower's dead. For a battle where we don't really have the best graveyard counters, I'm actually pretty okay with what we did. Obviously, I probably could have played better at the end there. Uh, for that final push. Oh, but we didn't. That's that's what that's the that's the what matters, guys. We didn't. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was rough. That was rough, dudes. Honestly, though, splash shard is always difficult for hog rider, building and NATO. Yikes, man. All right, guys, let's go ahead here, jump into one replay to finish the video off. Maybe we'll do one more. Who knows? We'll figure it out as we go along. Uh, ooh, he's having a good old time, guys. He's laughing. He's laughing already, dude. And he's, he's very tired. He's like me. I'm very tired. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Anyways, he's rocking a graveyard deck. I wanted to, to redeem myself for that previous loss there. Because I know you guys are thinking that I'm a nub right now. Uh, but this is against another graveyard deck, all right? We actually do pretty well here. We, we kill the Dark Prince. Um, we kill the Musketeer here. Um, we zap the Skarmy. And then we get, look at this. One hog shot, two hog shots, three hog shots, four hog shots, plus a Sparky Blast. And, uh, yeah, he's destroyed. We even get extra value sauce there, guys. With the Musketeer getting hit by the Sparky as well. So I'm definitely okay with that. Now, obviously, Roberto... Robert. I don't know why I call him Roberto. Robert doesn't have nearly as good of a deck in this matchup that the previous guy had. The previous guy had Furnace, which, as you guys saw in the live battle, Executioner is a nub. Doesn't know how to kill Fire Spirits. Sparky is a nub. Doesn't know how to kill Fire Spirits. Um... And then he's got Nato for the Hog Rider, Furnace for the Hog Rider, E Wizard for the Sparky, uh, Valkyrie for. Well, I don't know, just. He's got Valkyrie, okay? <laughs> but uh, look at this right here. I wait for the Musketeer to lock onto my tower, then we're gonna go Executioner first. Then we need to go back right here to destroy the, uh, the Giant, uh, which I think was the best way to defend that without losing our tower. Because if I would have went Executioner earlier, the Witch probably would have destroyed him, and then we probably would have just lost the tower, anyways. We also get one execution shot to the tower left lane, guys. Bring it down to 2900 health. But uh, I'm okay with it. Anyways, what I was saying is that um, that previous battle, I think his deck was a lot better suited to counter ours than this one. So we do a little bit better here because his deck isn't nearly as good. But uh, yeah, I'm still unfortunate and sad that that last battle we lost. We're going to go Skarmy here to destroy his Musketeer. He does snowball it, but watch this right here. We natal, we zap the Skarmy here. We nailed back the giant. The tower does indeed go down to that Skarmy. Because I probably should have nailed that instead. But lessons were learned. Mistakes were made. Going to go Mega Knight here, left lane. We are now in the deficit here. He came back into the lead with the tower on my left side uh, being pretty low. But thankfully, the Mega Knight's a beast. And the Spark is even beastier. Shooting that Dark Prince. Destroying his tower. Giving us the two crown lead. Going to go all in here for the three crown. Basically force him to defend himself. Because, obviously, my tower left lane is at 1,400 health. If he goes in an offense, he probably destroy our tower. My best offense, my best defense here, guys, is going offense and forcing him to play defense. And it ends up working out right there. We have ourselves a two-crown victory. Alrighty, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, one more replay over here against Horn Power. The power of the horn. Alright? Watch out for that horn, guys. Very powerful, apparently. Anyways, um, what was I saying? He's got a P.E.K.K.A. deck, alright? So, P.E.K.K.A. normally destroys Mega Knight... Uh, and then he has, I don't know, Pekka Minor Control, I guess, with E-Wizard for my Sparky, for extra sauce. But thankfully, we have Executioner, which destroys his minions and his uh, Witch. 
Sparky does work as well. Gonna go a Hog Rider here, actually pulls back the Dark Prince, allows the Executioner to miss it like a nub. Honestly, guys, I think the the Executioner, yes, it's strong. Yes, it's like the damage is insane. But honestly, I feel like it's so awkward and clunky to use. They made it they made it stronger, obviously, but they made it way, way clunkier, I feel like. Like it just feels so awkward to use because it just never hits anything. There's so many weird interactions, like you know, for example, when it watches a Fire Spirit jump into its face before doing anything. And there's so many times that I see the Executioner, like he's so slow to attack his first attack, that like, he'll sit there and try and attack something, and then the target dies, but he throws his axe anyways, does nothing, changes target to another skeleton, goes to throw, skeleton's already dead. And it, it, like, I've seen videos of him doing like nothing for 30 seconds straight because he's just, he's so slow. So he just, they kind of, they kind of made him more awkward and clunkier, if that makes sense. So, and I feel like a lot of it has to do with his first attack speed and his limited, like, axe range. Like, previously it used to be able to hit things behind things. Now it can't. Anyways, I don't know. It's kind of weird. He overcommits there with a lightning spell. So I'm going to go Hog Rider here to punish. He's going to get a P.E.K.K.A. down. Actually, he does not. He doesn't go P.E.K.K.A. Do you know why he doesn't go P.E.K.K.A.? I'll give you guys a perfect answer why he did not go P.E.K.K.A. right there. If he went P.E.K.K.A., we had E Wizard and Sparky, okay? Let's say he goes Pekka for the Hog Rider. He kills the Hog Rider, my Sparky kills his Pekka, and then he's wasted 60 Elixir. So I think in his mind, he was uh he was like sacrificing his tower for a bigger push right now, but it doesn't doesn't really work out the way he wanted it to, because the execution destroys his uh his witch. He's asked my Skarmy too late, and he, he's dead. He's dead, guys. He's gonna go in here and just get destroyed right now in the right lane. And uh, unfortunately for him, guys, he's having a bad day today. E Wizard destroying the minion horde there. Gonna go Sparky here, left lane for the defense. And my friend Horn Power is very, very tired, as you guys can see. Uh, I'm also very tired, but I don't, I don't use the the tired emote because um, if I'm tired, I just, I don't know, what, 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 I don't know what I do. I was gonna, I was gonna have a cool joke there, but then I, I didn't have anything, so Preve just pretend I didn't say anything. All right. Gonna go Mega Knight here for that Sparky, guys. And the Mega Knight does actually defend and prevent damage. He's gonna go a minor E Wizard left lane here with seven seconds left, guys. Not enough time for him. And uh, there we go. We just bust out a pretty solid one crime victory. And uh, now his, his, his mood is increased. He's happy, no longer tired. And uh, we are good to go here. Anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. Here's the deck one more time if you wanna go ahead and uh, give it a try yourself. 4.3. Absolute disgusting deck. Hog Rider, Mega Knight. Uh, you have just like Executioner, NATO for some nastiness, uh, Zap Bait, Sparky for some nastiness, E Wizard for other Sparkies, Mega Knight, just the beast right now, and Hog Rider uh, is, is Hog Rider, right? What else needs to be said about that? Uh, anyways, we did pretty well with it today. We, we forget that battle happened. We didn't do anything, guys. We won three in a, in a row, and then. Uh, then I guess we, we lagged out here, right, guys? Right? We lagged, right? <laughs> that was lag's fault. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. Really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Subscribe to my Clash World content. Thank you so much for watching. We shall see you in the next one.